Hey, this is my living room. No, I'm just kidding. We're actually on a soundstage here at Hollywood. And only here at BackstageOL.com, we go backstage with the cast of the upcoming movie, Warcraft. We will continue this party, this Warcraft party. Did you, <laughs> did you guys actually play the game? He did. I did. Really? Um, yeah, I, I dedicated yeah. Um, a large portion of my life to this game. I was a professional player for a long time, and uh, I was uh, one of the, in the, one of the top guilds in the world. And You know, I, 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 this game was, uh, means an awful lot to me. You're dropping the lingo. Look at this yeah. guy. I didn't play the game, but, you know, I know. Should I leave now? No, no, no. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> did you? I actually didn't, no. I had friends who played the game. I was obviously aware of it and knew, was aware of its significance in the history of, um, the gaming, of role, pantheon. The, the gaming yeah. pantheon. Thank you. Yeah, it's that British vocabulary. Um, but um, the script drew me in. Right. And, and the opportunity to work with Duncan and work with this team was, uh, was crazy exciting. And I think he did a great job of giving equal weight to both sides of this story. It's not a cookie cutter, uh, cut and dry, good guys and bad guys. It's a layered, character-driven story. And when you've got a world that is so rich in mythology, I mean, the resources are abundant to, to, to make a film. Mm. I want to talk about the fight scenes, which were incredible to watch. Right on. But I imagine shooting, did anybody get hurt, by the way? No, I don't think anybody did. Not crazy. I mean, there, there were there were a couple of times because you know we spent a lot of our time with the stun guys, and we would set up mats and just play and like jump and roll. And there were plenty of times where I'd fall on my head, but no one got hurt in the actual making of the film. Just in like the wasting of time. What was the adrenaline like though when you're actually filming these fight scenes? Was were you just? It's you know you you get you get you get jacked, especially when you're like if you got to fly or you're like blasting someone and you're up in the air. That's that's pretty gnarly. There was a scene where you're up in the air. Yeah, yeah. There was one where I had to. I don't know how much I can say. I had to get climb off of a creature and run. And but but I was harnessed to it. Yeah, yeah. And so what they had to do, I had to land and then get off. And I just had to trust that one of the special effects guys was going to undo my harness because I'm supposed to sprint. Right. And the whole time I was running, knowing I had just been tethered to something, and I was like, dude, if I'm in a full on sprint and he doesn't undo it in time, yeah, then. There's always a you know there's always a risk when you're doing any of the stunt work, but um, the the best thing about a good f a film like this is they hire the best people. Exactly. So we had a really really great stunt team that kept us safe most of the time, and and that was a lot of fun. And they're like cool people. They like are. it was just fun to hang out with them. Yeah, and we just picked their brains yeah. about. Was it like getting lit on fire? And you know, <laughs> is it fun to play fantasy roles? like these? Uh, pretty much my entire career has been science fictional fantasy and there's a reason for that is because it's just much more fun. You know, I would much rather play uh, Orgrim Doomhammer or, you know, Chuck Hansen or, you know, or, or, or Warlow in True Blood rather than playing Dave the Accountant. You know, it's just, it's, these are better worlds. They're mm. more extreme worlds with more, you know, with, with just a, a happier place to live in, a scarier place to live in, a fun place to live in. I'd much rather be doing this than, than writing numbers in a ledger. I like that. All right, before I leave, for the horde? Of course, for the horde. Don't, you know. <laughs> but, but you can't just say it like that. All right, for the horde! There you go. Your turn. For the alliance. Yeah, there you go. That's, <laughs> that's exactly the difference between horde and alliance. Yeah, that, <laughs> what do the other people say? What are, the other, what, what are they saying in the other room? They're saying for the horde, actually. They're saying for the horde? People Is walk Travis out of the movie the screaming Is Travis saying for the horde? Everybody's kind of, yeah, everybody's kind of like. You know what? Dude, it. I'm not even kidding. People leaving the theater, we're kind of like, <laughs> I'm not like, wow, you've started something. Yes. Anyway. Right on. I love it. Hey, nice guys, one, nice man. to meet y'all.